Little Hope. I don't know a lot about these. Um, I think the town, like, we get stuck in a town called Little Hope or something like that. From what I gathered from comments. But I don't know uh, if we're going to, supposed to go to Little Hope or what. We'll find out. Okay. Is this the bus driver? I assume so. Yeah. Oh, we got passengers now. Oh, I don't know if I should turn the music off. I didn't think about that. Can I look around? Nope. Time out. Let's uh, music. Let's just uh, just in case turn off. Yes, turn off the music just in case. Kind of sucks not having music, but you know, also kind of helps with the ambience of like ambience or whatever. However you want to say that. We're getting pulled over. Oh no, they got the roadblock. Oh, just to help yourself Thanks in. Pulling over. Sure. Something wrong? We got a problem up ahead. A big accident. We've had to close the road. Uh, right. We're diverting all traffic through Little Hope. You okay, oh. buddy? You seem a little confused. Yeah, I'm fine. I just want to get these folks to where they need to be. I doubt a short delay will trouble them too much. Head up the East Road. Takes you straight through Little Hope. Adds almost no time to your journey. Yeah, well, I have a funny feeling you're wrong about that. Chip any harder, it'll wear away to nothing. Something's gonna appear in the road, and we're gonna die. Impressive. I heard the first 90 days are the toughest and roughest. I know it doesn't add up, but I get something from holding on to this. We're going the wrong way. It's fine, just a quick detour. It's not fine. Calm down. It's all okay. Oh, hey. please, John, could you not patronize me? Can you keep it down, please? Oh. Yeah. All right. Yeah. The, seen that coming. What? Rearing up. Bearing up. Take what? A girl stood in the road, caused the bus. Okay, so, okay. Let's just get what? Just gives you a little, yeah. Rundown, that's what happened, even though we just seen it. I don't remember it snowing. Stop it, James. You know I hate it when you don't take the things I say seriously. Come on, sweetheart, I do. I just had a rough day today. Can you yeah. believe they are at each other again? I can. You're drunk. 
What a surprise. I just caught the game with the guys, honey. That's it. That's yeah, not geez, it. Yeah, lady. There's talk. Some of us may be losing our jobs. The factory... You've been saying that for years. I'm more worried about Megan. What's wrong with Megan? She looks okay to me. Everything looks okay after 10 beers. Reverend Carson is back after press. That's fair. That's four weeks running. She's not right. It's serious, James. You worry too much about that kid. I can't deal with this right now. Another surprise. You can't deal with anything. When would be the right time? You're making a mountain out of a molehill. Getting yourself worked up for nothing. For nothing? Single-handedly keeping our family together Sam is far from nothing in my book. I could use a little help. Maybe if we'd had kids of our own, none of this would be happening. That's a real Oh, low damn. Low. Don't you get how tough You're this is? You're not the only me? one feels pressure. The factory situation is serious, Anne. Real serious. Not right now. <sighs> not tonight. No way. What? Oh, it was. The movie. I guess she watches it a lot. Anthony Clark Family Daniel's Home, late. Massachusetts. She always is these days. What? Give her a break. Uh. Oh no! I don't. One of us is out having a good time. All right. Give well, her a break. Cool. It's him I'm worried about. That guy's no good for her. All that new age bullshit. Reminds me of some creepy cult. <clears throat> he came in last week. We shot the breeze a little bit. I like him. That one's a classic. Legendary vinyl. Quit pawing at it, will you? <clears throat> Quit sitting so close to the TV. You don't go blind, girl. Oh, that's messed up, man. Hey, Bigfoot, mind the goddamn vinyl, will you? There's no need to be so tough on her. It was an accident. Everything Megan does is an accident. I didn't read the other option, but whatever. Damn ice. Why do I keep the I'm key in the door? I'm going to start climbing through the window unless that door gets fixed. How's things? Let me guess. He's been pumping iron again? They've been at each other's throats since Dad got home. What's it about this time? Dad's been drinking some... some Dad Dad's been that. drinking. Who could have guessed it? They're always fighting these days. Getting predictable. Like a record that keeps playing over and over. Dennis, for the 10 million time, will you shift that shit of yours up into the hey, attic? Some respect. This is a valuable, rare, and sought after collection. <laughs> Think she was a Marine sergeant of past life. It's crawled up his ass. Just Dennis doing what he's good at being really Dennis. A surprise. Hey, Dennis. <clears throat> hey. Not now, sis. I'm busy. That creepy little girl. I'm not gonna lie. Little kids scare me, man. <gasps> oh. Hey. Quit acting crazy. What the uh, hell? Jesus. You scared me, sweetheart. I heard you talking about me. Not now, Megan. I'd like to have a bath in peace. Take a break from this madhouse for a while. Uh. Yeah, Megan. Megan something's wrong with Megan. Um, 
Maybe you should talk to mom and dad. It's not a great idea for me to get involved. You know what I'm like? I just upset someone. They sounded more serious than the usual bullshit. They were talking about Megan. She's done something bad. I can't say I'm surprised. There's definitely something off with Megan. I don't get why everyone keeps picking on her. Okay, Mr. Shining Knight in Armor. Where's the little princess anyway? Uh, go check on her. Megan's gone upstairs. Maybe you could go check on her if you don't have other plans. Yeah, because she might, you know, kill mom. Or the brother. I don't know. Press and hold R2 to pick up objects, to examine some interactions, reveal secrets, secrets you find can't be viewed in the collection in the character menu. Okay, cool. Uh, what's this? Matches. Neat. Awesome. Um, why is this important? Oh. We're going to burn the house down. Some time with her may change to the triangle. Oh, okay. sister. Mom is real worried about her. Can't imagine why. It's okay. Tanya's checking on her. Tanya's checking on her right now. Or Tanya, you want to I try guess. raising a family like this? The devil himself would struggle with you guys. Well, that's nice, Dad. Oh, I can move around. Check on Tanya. Okay, um, can't go that way. Hey, Tanya, you up oh. there? Now it's Tanya. How's Megan doing? Don't know, haven't seen her yet. Keep it down, will ya? Trying to sleep here. Now you've done it, Sleeping Beauty wakes. Forget him, find Megan. Relax, I'm on it. Do me a favor. Quit yelling for a couple of minutes. House could use some quiet. Sure, no problem. Not another sound. Place is crazy enough without your two cents. It's all the noise about anyway. Just checking in with Tanya and Megan. <laughs> Good luck with that. Megan's a handful. It's a real winner day out there. All right, uh, let's go uh, go down here, I guess, huh? Nope, nope, nope. Turn around. Can I open doors? Open door? No. Oh, I can open that door. Sure, why not? Nope, just kidding. Open this one? Nope. Uh, what's this? R2. Pupil name, Megan Clark, attendance. One, two, three, four, uh, no days present. Days absent. Days tardy. Uh, six week periods. Okay. So... So she's not doing great. She uh, doesn't like science much. And she doesn't like physical ed. P. She doesn't like much of anything. She's been reading kind of a little bit. Alright, cool. Um, neat. Uh, what's this? 
I, I'm... Anthony, where are you, goddammit? Anthony, I'm getting really pissed off! Anthony, I swear if you don't answer me... Now the door opens. You could be right about my family. What? I think so, too. What the Tanya. shit? What's going on? That little brat locked me out. It's fucking freezing. Yeah, okay. I'll let you back Same. in. Go easy on Megan. Hold on. Fire really takes shit. off. Megan! You in there? The kitchen's on fire! Are you fucking serious? That's gas, Megan? too. She went around and locked everybody. She locked her in the bathroom. Help! Oh! Anthony! Hey! Up here! What the fuck are you doing up there? I got trapped in the attic. Get to the balcony! Anthony, help! help! Break the window, man. Hey, Dad! There was a shovel right next to the door. Damn, Dad sleeps through anything. Or rock, that works too. Hey, Dad! I can't breathe! Oh, the ceiling is gonna collapse, huh? What the hell? Oh, yeah. Yep. He's fine. He'll be alright. Yeah, I told you that's why I don't like kids, man. No, don't help her. Don't help her. Don't help her. Help. Help her. Oh. Oh, damn. Anthony! Help! What should I do? She had it coming, though. I... Use the uh, climb up the... Sure. Get to the drain pipe and climb down. Sure. That's probably not a good idea, but I mean, I don't know. Windows probably not a good idea either. Oh yeah, ice. Sorry, I might have killed you. Yeah. Oh. Oh God. Oh. Well, um, shit. I mean, he doesn't seem all that. Everybody's gonna die. I'm terrible at the making. Oh, that wasn't on me. That was you. Yeah. What have you done? About I didn't. Mom, stop! What? What the? F
All right, cool. So, pretty sure we made every wrong decision. So much death. Okay. Cool. Don't know if I'm going to include that in the video or not, because that probably will be cut right. I don't believe that we've met before, have nope. we? Nope. Nope. No matter. Welcome to my repository. I am the curator, the guardian of all these wonderful stories. And I have a very special tale for you to tell. Disconcerting, no? I'm sure there's nothing to worry about. This particular story isn't fully fleshed out. It's only part written, and the choices you make will complete it. Well, it's gonna be a pretty shitty the story, fire. man. No, there was nothing you could have done about that. Oh, What's okay, happened cool. Has happened. Or has it? I don't know. Anyway, you tell me. look to the future, I say. Life's but a walking shadow, eh? You are about to enter a confusing, perhaps disturbing world. How disturbing might depend on what you choose to believe. I don't do good under pressure. On the path you choose to take. Cool. It's going to be uh, pretty disturbing there are and confusing. An infinite number of directions in which one could travel. That's a lot of. We that's sell a lot of choices. We all the information that we like, but we have to choose our path nonetheless, and hope that we get the clarity and the outcomes that we want. As in life, your decisions will matter. The choices you make will affect others. Awesome. You've seen how the story starts. So much death. How many yeah. more deaths is entirely up to you. It depends on the decisions that you make. What are you? Rational? Emotional? Do you trust your head or your heart? There is no right answer. Sometimes yeah, great, because I don't know the answer. The other. My advice for what it's worth is to thine own self. Be true. All right, well. But uh, <laughs> I'm here simply to record what you do, not to help you. <clears throat> I'm not supposed to interfere, you see. Not my place, apparently. But I am. Apparently allowed to share wise words from great storytellers that have gone before where I feel that that would be appropriate. Oh, one final thing before I let you go. There are pictures in Little Hope that will, if found, show you a vision of a possible future, something that may or may not happen. Use uh, them. Kay. They might help you. You have a funeral to attend. Off you go. Have fun. Hmm. I do enjoy a good funeral. Who says that? A funeral? I thought everyone died. Like he ran into the burning house. None of us here today can understand why this tragic accident happened. But we can take comfort from the knowledge that the family are together. Well, that's... God's loving embrace. Yeah. Maybe. They, uh... They probably don't want to be stuck with each other for eternity. They don't seem too fond of each other. Oh, we, 
we've lived. All right, cool. Andrew, 18, college student, anxious, detached. <clears throat> Where the hell are we? Oh, this is the bus. Taylor, 22, college student, headstrong, sensitive. College professional, rational, overbearing. Where the hell's Daniel? I can't find him. I don't know. Ah! Uh, instead of goofing around, you want to lend a hand here? Wait, uh, that looks like... Uh, what do you want me to do? What do you do? want me to do, John? Call for help, if you can manage that. I'm on it. I already tried once, but I'm on it. Hey, Andrew, buddy, how you doing? Where are we? What happened? Yeah, the bus crashed. We're okay, though, just shaking up. Why does he look like so? that? I thought he died. I don't remember being in any crash. You're, you're probably in shock. Maybe a mild concussion in there, too. Give yourself some time. Stay here. Don't move. <clears throat> Fucking thing, useless piece of crap! May as well be dead. Okay, take it easy. We'll figure out what to do. Oh, there's the driver. Oh, that's not the best driver. Daniel, 20, college student. I'm a little indefensive. My phone. Okay. Flashlight, nice. Mature student, abrasive. Understanding. Hey, anyone up there? Hey, Daniel, that you? John, good to hear you. Daniel? Taylor, you okay? I'm good. We're fine too, thanks for asking. You okay down there? I'm all right, nothing I can't deal with. Hey, John, any idea what caused the crash? Not sure. Looked like the driver swerved to avoid something in the road. He down there, by the way? Nope. No sign of him. Weird. He isn't up here either. Can you get back up to us? Looks pretty steep. I see a trail down here I could try. Great. Take the trail. Should take you to the road. We can regroup there. That's a plan. See you soon. It, it, they did. I'm a mess hey, Taylor. Help me get Andrew up on his feet, will ya? Wait, I don't remember anything. Who are you? It's okay. You're concussed. I'm John, you're a college professor. <coughs> we were taking a bus on a field trip, but that didn't work out so well. Crash wasn't on the curriculum. <laughs> uh, we'll find the others, get some help. Think of it as a character building exercise. <sighs> Teamwork at its finest. I had this dream. It was so real. Flames all around us. It was grim. That bang on the head must have been a beauty. That trail the others are on will come out down the road. We'll meet them there. Uh, why leave? We should talk this through. Why leave the bus? Not like we have somewhere better to wait. No. We could be here all night. Our best move is to get to the others, then head towards town. See if we can find some help. Where's the bus Where's driver? Where's the driver? Shouldn't he be back by now? The driver's done what we should be doing. Gone into town for help. Sure. You're right. Let's go. I'm with you. I'm right? The quicker we get help, the quicker we can all go home. Stick close behind me. Okay, um, cool. So where's the chick? I can't believe the driver just taking off like that and ditching us. Maybe you didn't realize. Could just be in shock. 
We're his responsibility, his passengers. He can't just stroll off. Hmm. Little hope. Abandon hope. All right, cool. That's that's nice. You know this place, Little Hope? No. I mean, I don't think so. You should both know Little Hope. How do I get out of here? Why should I? Yeah, why? Well, why why should I? I have heard of this place? Seriously, this place is steeped in history. Fascinating stuff. How do you know all this? Yeah. How do you know all this stuff anyway? <laughs> I'm a professional academic. I read books, unlike some. <laughs> Easy, Einstein. I can match everything you got with just a smartphone. Well, your phone isn't so smart without a signal. Okay. Um... Good to see you too. Um, what's up, guys? Finally. Everything okay? Sure. We took the scenic route. You sure as hell took your own sweet time. I was getting worried. They got they're at literally the same time. Yeah, there's a chain. This book. gate is chained. We can't get through. Look around. See if there's anything we can use to break it. Think this'll do it? Ready? I'll push hard from my side. Ready. Three, two, one, push. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Great job, you two. You did it. What's gonna work? Teamwork. What's the plan now? Head into town, see if we can get help. You know where town is? Sure, we're near Little Hope. Sounds like a fun place. Funnily yeah, it's enough, great. Little Hope does have an interesting and dark history. Let's just Can we get going. going without having a smart-ass lecture first? I'm starting not to like you or your attitude. Hey, lady. I'm not even started yet. You want a little more? Try to be civil. Cost nothing. That's rich, given how you badmouth Taylor on the way over. What did she say about me? You always get your boyfriend to stick up for you? Try doing it yourself sometime, dear. All right, old lady. You're kidding. He is not my boyfriend. What have you been telling her? I didn't say a thing. Keep out of our business, okay? We are wasting valuable time here. Can we please just keep moving? Well, apparently I pissed off everybody. this is a solid everybody. plan, heading into town? As good as any. I went along with it before, but I'm not so sure now. So what do you want to do? How about you come with me back to the bus? I'm with the professor on this one. Our best play is heading into town. I'm getting some help. Um, How about yeah. you? You want to head back to the bus with me? Thing is, I think going into town is probably our best shot at finding help. Fine. Come on, Taylor. Don't check out on us. It's a bad idea to be out here walking around alone. Come with us. Don't worry about me. I'll flag down the first car I see and come get you all real soon. Yep, she did. Come with us. Are you kidding me? I'm not going anywhere with you. Well, kind of screwed that one up, I think. Probably. What? What? I walked away from you! Uh-huh. So you thought better of going it alone, then? Why'd you come back? I don't get it. It doesn't make any sense. Lost in a world of her own. What the hell are you playing at? You going or not? Hey, wait. What are you doing? Taylor. Look out. What the? What's going on with you? Why do you keep coming back? I'm not coming back. I walked straight out every time. It's like, I don't know. I can't fucking leave or something. Okay, let's try something. We'll all go together. We came from that direction. We must be able to go back that way. I want everyone to stay real close. No stragglers. You want to put us on a kid's line? <clears throat> okay, okay, right? I'm coming. 
Hmm. Had to take a brief break. Had to eat. And I ate too much. Now my tummy hurts. And we're back. Weird. Cool. So she wasn't going crazy. I admit that is a little odd. A little odd? It's not possible. It's just like I've been saying, we are trapped. We can't leave here. No, okay. what can we do? Calm down, breathe. There's a rational explanation for what's happening. Yeah, we all rational. Died in a crash. Yeah, nice theory, but I'm pretty sure we're all still alive and kicking. Last I checked, you were schooling us on creative writing, not metaphysics. I know who I'd like to be kicking. This is all down to you, this pissy little field trip. Now we're stuck here in little no hope. That is way out of line. I had no way of knowing that damn bus would crash. You can't put that on me. Are you for fucking real? Watch your tone, will you? I am doing my best to understand this, just like you and the rest of us. I'm sorry. I don't get what's happening to us. I don't understand. It's like you said, we're trapped in a nightmare. It's okay. We're gonna be just fine. We'll figure a way out of this together. Well, Someone I wanna else know. thinks they can do a better job? Step right up. Maybe, Maybe it isn't real. real. We have to get what's out with of the here. Right? I need to think straight. Now. What's All happening? Coaching. Why the fuck? Can everyone just shut up? All high as fuck. This isn't helping us find help or getting us out of here. He's right. Bitching at each other isn't getting us anywhere. We have to work together as a team. Thank you. Now let's be logical. The fog is between us and the bus. There is no fog between us and town, so let's head that way. I don't get how heading further away from the bus helps. There is nothing on the bus we can use to get help. In town, there will be people, a working phone, something. It pains me to admit, but he's right. There is nowhere else we can go except into that damn town. Sounds like a plan to me. You leaving me? Where are you going? You gonna stay Come with on. the spooky fog, you crazy? Until we know what's up, we should stick together. <sighs> Alright, cool. But what I wanna know is... The little girl, Megan, or whatever the hell her name is, was like, she Why adopted? Why we might all be dead? You really think that's possible? I saw some cable show about how your brain keeps going for a while after you, you know. You die? Forget about it. What they said didn't really stack up. Kit Kat! I don't like the look of that place at all. Is that cat following me or going to turn? Oh, there, there it goes. Um, okay. Wonder what the significance of that was. What? I'm not sure this is such a great idea. We should check it out. There could be a phone inside. I'll go in and take a look around. Yeah. Go ahead. <laughs> we'll be right behind you. Big tough guy. Yeah, go go ahead, man. Why aren't we going with those guys? Because look I at the creepy ass house. You. you said I wasn't your boyfriend. Like what a joke idea that is. Are you for real? Our bus gets totaled, we get lost in fog, and your headline is some dumbass label? You're admitting boyfriend is not a label that you use for me. So what the fuck am I then? Lighten up, man. Lighten up. You know I was only messing with you. Yeah. You didn't sound like you were messing just now. You don't believe me? Uh, let's just, no, let's just go with what? that. You don't believe me? It's not that I don't believe you, it's just... I want to be able to talk openly about us. Bro, your dick just ain't that good. I'm not ready to go public about us yet. I will be soon, I promise. Anything I can do to help convince you I'm the right guy? I need to know 100% I can rely on you. That you'll never let me down. Yeah. Catch up with the others. Like protect me from you know whatever spooky crap is gonna happen. Here all night, or are we going inside? <clears throat> I would never go in that building. With a cat back? 
kitty? Holy sh... Okay. I was expecting a Kit Kat, not like a fucking spear. Man, business is booming. You don't even have power, you just have a lantern. Hi there. How you doing? Excuse me, but we're uh, looking for our bus driver. What? Have you seen him? <laughs> yeah, that's funny. What is? What's up with the fog outside? It's pretty weird. Yeah, it sure is a thick one tonight. So thick it's stopping us from leaving. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I know that feeling. You mean you're trapped uh, Sorry too? for busting in like this. Uh, bus we were on crashed a little way back up the road there. We're still a little shaken up. We're still a lot shaken up. You certainly look shook up. I'm Vince. I need a mirror. Maybe there's one here not covered in 20 years. Of Sounds like you could use a drink. Better not, thanks. What? Need to keep a clear head. Speak for right yourself, you bro. Your mind. Mm, probably shouldn't, though, huh? Yeah. Then they say it was like for me. 90 days or something like that. Why are you even here? Little Hope sure isn't the town it used to be. What are you doing here? Yeah, why, why are you here, what bro? What are you doing in here alone? I'm sure you have a good reason to be here. Right? Yeah, I got my reasons for being here. Wanna tell us about it? They're, no, we need a phone, bro. There a phone in here? We can use a way of contacting the outside world. There's a phone. But it's been dead for years. You know, maybe there's still one working in town. What is this guy's problem? There's definitely something off about him. <laughs> uh, he's harmless. Just had one too many. Let's look around. There must be something here that can help us. <sighs> See if you can dig up. Uh, Alright, so I should look out for of pictures. Own. An old darts board. I was pretty good back in the day. Stay. Play a little, no problem. I'm gonna take a look around. Yeah, she's gonna die. <clears throat> Unlikely. <clears throat> At least I'm looking for a way out. What are you Just doing? a quick throw, and then we'll figure out how we're getting out of here. Try for a big double. Or... Not my first time, Daniel. Shooting for double twenty. What? R two. Okay, so you can play a little. Still got it. Now for triple twenty. Well, almost an Olympic shot after the night we've had. They don't play darts in the Olympics. <laughs> that is one hell of a shot. <laughs> He did better than Taylor. Let's get back to why we came in here. Oh, so I'm all right. Um, talk to Vince. Search the bar. Yep. Oh, I'm probably gonna die. Uh, can't go in there. Why, why, put the put the phone down. Put the phone down. Fuck. Cool. Um. Hmm. Who's Vince? Is that the the, the drunk dude? I can't turn around. There we go. I just gonna sit and. All right. Cool. What's this? 
Oh, there's all kinds of shiny stuff. What's this? Newspaper. Um, oh my. Okay. Meeting votes for. I vaguely remember what happened here. What? All the factories closed down. Um. Okay. I love the whole town hall on Monday. The last resident of the town met with emergency manager Kathy Flint to vote for disincorporation. Since the closure of the Ravenden textile factory and mass exodus has left the town with new inhabitants and empty coffer coffers, Flint was appointed as emergency manager manager to administer public services to the remaining residents but the latest round of bank foreclosures means the last of the townsfolk are planning to pack up and move on which will leave little hope virtually deserted oh there's okay with no tax revenue coming in we're faced with no option but to disincorporate said flint it is so sad these people have seen their town disappear around them attempts to Okay, whatever. Cool. Neat. Um, yeah. Uh, I don't want to go outside. There's a madman with an axe. Or a mad something. Uh, not an axe, a spear. June 6, 1917. I can't believe oh. it. These guys could be relatives. Okay. Yeah, cool. Neat. Um, can I read this? Uh, what? Astrology, spirits, history. or ghosts? Are your children interested in astrology, spirits, or ghosts? Rev Carson will advise parents on signs to watch for and how these things are the left hand path to delinquency and satism. Little Hope Town Hall, Tuesday, 6 16, 1970. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Yeah, um, alright. Guess, uh, well, we're not going outside, that's for sure. We'll, uh, hey, bud. What's up, man? No, talk to him. <gasps> what? Got anything else for us on Little Hope? Uh, boo's gone in my head. Listen to me. Are you, are you okay, bud? You okay? I'm sure it's just one too many. We both had better days. I have to drink. Can you help us? Yeah, this can is... you help us or not? Anything you can do to help us would be greatly appreciated. <laughs> There's no goddamn us. Huh? Search the bar, continue toward town. Dismissive, irritable, curious, overbearing. Oh, I can look around. Okay, cool. Um, alright. I don't really see a whole lot else. Can't talk to them. I read that, read that. I don't want to go outside, but how do I open door? Hey, this way. Let's get out of here and. Huh? You all hear that? I definitely I heard. I didn't hear something. anything. Did you hear that as well? Come on. Whatever it was, came from outside. Really think it's smart to go? Yeah, let's go out towards the noise. Here. We need to move on. Best of luck. Hope you find what you're looking for. What? He didn't get three bullseyes.
black cat bar. Oh, hey, there is a black cat. It's all coming together now. The cat's the bar. It's coming from the town. Oh. Did the old fucker just lock us out? He was weird, that old guy. Sure was something off about him. Why come to Creepy Central just to get a top up? What does that mean? Oh, now we're Andrew. Alright, cool. Alright, well. Damn, wait up, guys. What the hell was that noise? I have a bad feeling about this. We'll figure it out. The way this fog just appears, it's not natural. Can you two make an effort to keep up? <laughs> oh, what the? Jesus, that got me. Wait, I'm the old lady now? No, I'm not the old lady. Wait, where'd they go? We're gonna die. We're gonna die, lady. Oh my. Hey, can you come over here? What's wrong? I just saw someone in the woods. I can't see anyone. I definitely saw someone. 100%. Sorry, I don't buy it. Nobody will be out here at this ungodly hour. Better find the others. Okay. We really should catch up with the others. You too. Wait, we need what to stick the close. hell? You don't see that? Take the old lady. I don't like the old lady. Okay, very good. We're freaked. Who's there? Whoever you, you are, this is funny at all. Run. Get John, away. Where are you? Daniel? Taylor? Come on, John. Where are you? This isn't funny. Yeah, she did. Get, get away, get away, get away, get away. Stay close to Angela. Find the other, no, I ain't staying close to her. She gonna die. Hey, wait for us. What the? F what is that? What's, what's this? Probably shouldn't touch. I learned this in Blair Witch. Don't touch rocks that you find. Yeah, hey. Let's look. Hey, I found a rock. Come and check this out. It's pretty cool. Oh no, it's a little doll. What on earth is that? Yeah. Not you a should, clue. You should grab it. Not you, the old lady. Let's not. Let's not touch that. Let's not touch that. I... Oh. <laughs> oh my, what the... <laughs> yep, we're dead. Sis is gonna kill us. What is your name, sir? I, you don't remember me? Um, I'm, uh, I'm polite. Yeah, I'm Andrew. I'm Andrew. Andrew? And yeah. your name, lady? I didn't touch your doll. Who the hell are you? Kill her. Why are you dressed like that? Kill, what? The, why are you I judging her? Called that Mary. is mean. Mary. I fashioned her with my own hand. Oh, that's cool. I like her needle. She looks just like the one beside you. Oh, son of a... Would you kindly come play with me? Nope. Come play. Oh, lady, if you touch my weird boo boo doll... Come play with me. Which is trickery is this now, Mary? What the... I've done nothing. Hold your tongue. I see what you truly are, Mary. Reverend Carver's affection for you will be shaken loose when he learns of your infidelity with the devil. Um. Ime. Ime, come back here. There's someone else out here by the fire. Oh. Why? Do I, I don't see any fire. I saw them too. 
Are you okay? Um. It, uh, sure. How can you not have seen that? I couldn't see anything through this impossible, impenetrable fog. Well, go ahead. Tell them what we saw. A little girl appeared out of the fog, and then just like that, she was gone again. What is going on? Maybe the fog has got you confused. We're all stressed out. Stressed my ass. I saw a girl dancing right here, clear as day. Said her name was Mary. Looked exactly like the girl in my dream, but... She talked in this really weird accent. Was that even American? I'm not sure. I couldn't place what? her accent either. What have we gotten ourselves into? This kid, Mary, did she want to hurt you? Uh, let's, just, no. let's just assume she's nice. I don't think she meant to hurt me. Now what? Seems our only option is the road into town. You're kidding me. Got a better idea? Thought not. Huh, cool. Creepy little girl trying to kill us. Why is it always kids in scary games and movies, man? Oh, it's this guy again. How am I doing so far? Well, that escalated rather quickly. Everything that one does or doesn't do in one's life will catch up with one eventually. Don't you think? Don't look at me. I can't help you. Remember? Yeah, you've told me. Kind of a jerk. We sometimes congratulate ourselves on waking from a troubled dream. It may be so the moment after death. On my travels over many years, I've witnessed many things, seen and heard many beliefs, and there's usually some there's nothing in that glass but truth in each of them. These unfortunate folk seem to be dealing with forces as yet unexplained. I mean, sinister movements in the forest, spirits from the past, a little girl who may be in trouble. Or maybe she simply is trouble. Anyway, where are we? Angela isn't getting much tittle-tattle out of Taylor. <laughs> no kiss and tell. What about John? The figure of authority, perhaps. Or perhaps he represents something else. And then there's Andrew. Somewhat confused, I think. A bump oh, to the think? head can do that. Yeah, I'm Let running me into a burning you. building. You help make some decisions that will be valued later on. Oh, great. So far, so good. You're doing well. Oh, thanks. That fellow in the bar. He was less than helpful. More than a little rude, if you ask me. Clearly something disturbing on his mind. Enough. There's something not quite right in Little Hope. And so I'll give you that idea. Peril. Off you go again. See if you can lift the fog. Find the bus driver. Oh, this looks nice. Little girl, she sounded so strange. I could barely understand her. She sure sounded like she wasn't from anywhere around here. Now, I'm tempted to say she sounded oh, more like she was lady. from another time than another place. You're right. Do we do we go in the house? Do we go in the house? Andrew, Andrew, over here, buddy. I'm gonna, I'm gonna check this out. There's a shiny salmon. Uh. Oh. Oh. Okay. 
Um, uh, cool. Yeah. Let's just put that down. All right. I regret everything. Let's not look at that. Let's go back this way. You hear that? What the? What was that? Um. It's gotta be something small, nocturnal. Small. Nothing to worry about. I really hope you're right. <laughs> you see that? Some yeah. Big ass animal. I hope so. It's if not. The, that's a deer. Might get a better view from up there. Or let's not get off the road. All right. Well. Okay. Don't listen to me. Is that a knife? Give me a weapon, that'd be cool. Ghost towns of the northeast. Um holy that's a lot. Alright, little hope the town returning to nature. The body and image of a ghost town in the popular imagination of an arid desert shack. Surrounded by tumbleweed, however, ghost towns exist, even in the lush northeast of the United States, buried away in forests. Forgotten and abandoned to nature. The reason for towns to become ghosts vary, but inevitably comes back to the economics. To economics. The town may have boomed from logging, mining, and industry. Then the jobs go, and the people with them. The aptly named Little Hope is one such town. A one factory community built around textiles that disappeared when cheap imports overwhelmed the market. After many attempts to save the mill, it closed and a mass exodus ensued. Soon the school and even the church closed, leaving a desolate ruin. And sad. Wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Uh, how do I turn? There we go. What's, uh, Hidden Depths? Little Hope is a deserted town. But the forests that surround it continue to lure extreme sports enthusiasts. The caverns and Hobbs Deep are... What is Hobbs Deep? Anyway, are famous for ice climbing, but its ice falls are known to be very dangerous. Recommended viewing. Architects of Unreadable. Okay. Um, unreadable, blah, 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 central. In this week's episode, Kate Wilder rips the mask off the Zodiac Killer. Zodiac Killer? What was that from? Um, anyways. But will her hard-hitting investigation style unearth any new facts about the notorious killer? Worth watching for, for the stunning views of San Francisco taken from the Golden Gate Bridge. Yeah. Alright, cool. Um, really glad I read all that. The beer bottle. Um, that, all right, let's talk to him, I guess. How are you coping? I don't know. What do you think happened to us back there? Makes no sense. I feel like we're in danger. Yeah, I kind of feel like we are too. I feel like we're in danger. There's something very off about this place. Yeah, I hear you. What is out there? We'll find a way out. Stay calm, bud. You need to stay calm and positive. Panicking won't help anyone, and I, for one, have no intention of spending any longer out here than is absolutely necessary. I'm right with you. Appreciate you checking in with me. the hell is that? Um. Okay. Alright, let's get the hell away from that, huh? Let's just make sure it's not coming in. Alright, cool. Alright, don't, don't go that way. Get out of the way. 
I want to read this. Presents The Witch of Edmonton. All right. Uh, a play by W.M. Raleigh, Thaw, Stecker, and John Ford performed in a historical dress at Little Hope Middle School. Neat. Could this have something to do with what we saw? It must be. It could be. Um, uh, no, let's see this. I guess it could, but it didn't feel like that. I don't know which is worse. Ghostly apparitions or a town full of historical weirdos. Is that the best driver? No, that's the little girl. There's nothing over there. What the hell is that? Tractor? It's a tractor. There's something up ahead. Yeah, it's a bridge. Neat. Which way? Can we move it? Amen to move, that. Move what? Did I miss something? I just look like a bridge. Oh. Look at that. Hey, wait. Stop. I'm just gonna say it. This is exactly what goes down in horror movies. Um. Yeah, she's not wrong. What the hell do we do now? I'll deal with this. Stay right here. Well, I'm Miss Ham. It was nice knowing you, buddy. Uh, gee, be careful. Be careful, please. Oh, I should have sent her with him so she didn't hey, die. Hey, Professor! W watch out, you're gonna die. Damn it! Well. It's just like what happened to us. You think the Professor will be okay? No, probably not. It's high time he stepped up. He's the one in charge. Finally, he's doing the right thing. I'm sure he'll be grateful for your concern. What is this? This was a mistake. I should have gone with John. He shouldn't have gone in alone. Don't give yourself a hard time. You think he's okay in there? No, he's probably dead. He'll be fine. Maybe a little shaken up is all. <sighs> this is bullshit. I feel so useless. Well, I mean, you haven't really done a whole lot. I have a bad feeling about this. <laughs> oh, hey, bud. Uh, well, well, welcome, welcome back. What? What's happening? Are you okay? lost my bearings. I couldn't see you through the thick fog. Did you see the little girl? I could see you back there. That's really odd, because I sure couldn't see you. Your clothes looked different, and your accent was off. You sounded like an actor in some historical play. It must Why have been is someone smiling? else you saw. I teach you. I know you. I recognized your face. Whoever you saw, it wasn't me. Now please stop. You're scaring me. I am all Did done she, like, possess him or something? Seems the fog won't let us go anywhere except into the center of town. The fog decides where we can and can't go? Fuck that. I'm trying another way. I mean, I kind of agree with her. 
Farquhar's Don't obviously. Don't you kids watch horror movies? You never ever split up. Those movies are dumb. And I'm going this way without you. Maybe splitting up isn't such a good idea, Taylor. No way am I going down there. <sighs> I'm with John. Um. Yeah, let's send her with I'm Taylor. I'm with Taylor. Seriously? You want to go with her? For me, this is a bad idea. Very bad. I'll team up with Taylor. It's not safe for you to be hanging around here on your own. Two teams are more likely to find a way out, which is what we all want, right? I guess you're right. If the fog lets you through and you find help, send them into town to find us. Just you and me, kid. Great. I'm glad you stuck with me. I'm not. I don't really trust you. Find help in town. Hold up. You hear that? Oh my. You son of a bitch. <laughs> was just the old guy from the bar on his bike stupid old drunk uh, somewhere around here there must be an easier way back up to the road let's move out you got an explanation for what we saw nothing that makes sense I do know there were witch trials in Little Hope around the same time as Salem now what Um, found a bloody axe. Cool. Oh my, what the? Run! 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 There's a fucking weird golem. Yep, go. Go. Get out of here. Stop looking at the axe. What was that? Was that something over there? Or just shadow? No, just shadow. Are you okay? Hey. I wonder where the others are right now. Feels like it's my fault we split up in the first place. I feel responsible for everyone here. You are all in my care. How would you handle all this in my position? I guess I'd try to stay positive, do my best. That's all anyone could do. Not sure my best is up to dealing with whatever is going on around us tonight. What we saw back there You think that was really supernatural? Um, we really can't be sure what it is we've seen. Makes sense to me. Just because I can't explain what we saw doesn't mean we have to reach the most extreme conclusion. That's kind of what happened in Little Hope during the witch trials. They made bad decisions based on very little hard evidence. Sure. I get that. Either way, our goal here is not proving or disproving the supernatural ghosts, whatever else. It's getting the hell out of here. The fuck was that? Um. A demonic pig? Why did it? Oh my. Yep. Wait. Yep. Cool. Alright, yeah, let's check this out. I like that guy. He keeps just abandoning us. It's really nice.
Oh. That cat was not making those noises. Get that out of this house. Alright, well, whatever. Um, examine. Uh, modern magical rituals. Look. Cool. Um, yeah. That's... Modern magical ritual is a definite, definitive guide to the subject of magic for the new age, as opposed to magic for stage magicians. Okay. Written for practitioners to hone their knowledge and art. This book examines in detail all aspects of modern magic and offers readers a rich menu of rituals to practice. Cool. Oh, but okay, we're opening it. All right. Um, a ponytail. Okay. Wait, what? Um, yeah, what? Yeah, I'm not going to read all of this. That's a lot. We're just going to... Neat. Thanks, uh, thanks for that. Um, hmm. This way? Examine. Ah, oh, we really shouldn't be taking, you know, stuff from... Oh, I mean, yes, we definitely should be taking stuff. Take that and shoot wait there was a someone wait a minute that picture okay sure um hmm all right whatever that picture we found someone got shot in the head and it was with a gun that kind of looked like that but you know whatever let's get out of here where the hell did that asshole go? Some on the tree. Oh, cool. Little arts and crafts in the woods. What kind of place is this? I mean, you were literally just talking about how uh, they practice witchcraft, so. Professor? There you are. You flipped out again. Just like you did on the road. You can't blame me for that. What the hell was that in there? It was huge and scary. It was nothing. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. What am I? In second grade? Yeah. I keep running like one. This place is our best shot. There must be a radio or a working phone inside. Maybe even our driver, too. Look around for something we can break the glass with. I mean, there's a stick literally right there. Right right here. Grab that. I mean, this place looks like it's 110 years old. Like, It's not going to take a whole lot to break it. Oh, what's this? Postcard. Of, uh, some, what? Uh. Well, she did. Okay. Cool. She's in a hole with some creepy thing. Um, where'd he go? Hello? Oh, there he is. Chair. This. Use this. Hit it with this. Pick up the chair. No. I've seen like 10 things that we could break that window with. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Rock! Cool. There you go. Did it. Give me that. 
I'll smash the window. No problem. I can do this. Okay. If you're sure. Anyone can do this. Not anyone. Putting a rock through a window at ten paces? Anyone can make the shot. If you're feeling under pressure, let someone else do it. I'm not feeling pressure. Just saying. Can you stop talking? Wait. Oh, strike! We'll make a ball player out of you yet. You think a rookie can make a shot like that? Looks safe enough. Oh. Uh. Piece of cake. He's gonna cut his hand or something. <clears throat> oh, never mind. that woman really looked like Angela? I don't know what John saw, and I don't intend on sticking around to find out. Hey, you guys went the wrong way. That little girl is over here. What's this say? What's that noise? Land for sale. Hey, we can, you know, no surprise, that buy didn't. some land. Cool. Uh. Wonder what closed the school down. Get about that. Even if you make it over, there's no way I'm following. Goes for both of us. I never did like school. Let's get out of here. Oh, looks like there's no way through. I might have made a bad call here. Don't stress it. No one made us come this way. We'll find another way. What the hell? Hey, you, hold up. That must be what we heard just now. Are you okay? Who are you? What are you doing here? Something is real off about this whole thing. This the same little girl you saw with Andrew before? She's dressed different. Don't get too close. Um No. <laughs> That didn't just happen. Quiet now. I'll be gone. What are you talking about? Get away, or you will find me. <gasps> oh. Come on out, Mary. I know very well you are in there. Please, no, let me go. I will release you once I am sure you will not speak of our secret. Your childish games tire me. You will respect me, and you will say nothing. No! Let go of her right now! Oh, he did. Huh? Oh! What spell have you cast? I am frozen to my marrow. I have done nothing. Amy is the caster of spells. She is the one in league with the devil. 
I saw her in the forest together with her familiars. I am innocent. I will have the truth one way or another. You come with me, girl. Thank you kindly. Be silent, child. Well, I guess we Can someone good. tell me what just happened? The girl with the priest. That's the one I saw with Andrew. There must be a connection between her and the other girl. I think you're right. I... I don't get it. We have to get away from here. Far away. Agreed. Let's go. Okay, uh, is there anything? No. Let's go. And the postcard. Well, weird shit's gonna happen now. <laughs> oh! Is that the same hole? Yeah, uh, it's looking like you're screwed, old lady. Um. I don't know how else to tell I'm you. Glad you're here. Both of us are getting out of here. You'll see. <clears throat> you're not. I literally just seen it, lady. Like you're, you're not. You're not gonna make it. Oh, see, there's a hole right around. here, huh? Maybe they can help. Let's head over. Yep. Yep, that Here, falls. Need a hand? You're, you're dead. I'm gonna miss her. Uh, it's nice knowing you. This takes us out of this shitty town. There's no road. Wherever it leads, it's wreaking havoc on my shoes. Must lead somewhere, though. I'm not so sure. There's barely even a path. Maybe some over here. Place must have been a grocery store or something. That campaign didn't work out too well. Closer. Okay. Um, well, there's all kinds of shit. Um, so we probably have to push this. Oh, grab it. Grab it! What are you doing? Help me push this, will you? Seriously? There's no other way. Oh, I've uh. got no choice. I actually thought we were supposed to pull it over there, but alright. What's this? Is that baseball? No, it's a 2 by 4 Over here, look at this. Want to close the blah blah factory and sell the blah 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 land of development. Would result in the blah 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 and devastate the community. The union has proposed and offered to save the factory in our town. Please sign our petition to persuade the Carver family to accept the union offer and reverse their decision. Ask for details from staff at the post office or town hall. Citizens for Little Hope and whatever local. Um, cool. All right. Um, nothing over there. I don't know, I 
guess we'll now try. Give me a leg up. I'm going for the stairwell. Seriously? You're going in there? Let me go in, look around. If it's all clear, I'll come and open the door. I'm not sure. I don't like the idea of being out here on my own. It'll be fine. You got Angela here with you. Don't take a Sunday morning stroll when you get in there. Be right back. Promise. Well, I might have just killed him, but... I need your phone. What for? Flashlight. It's dark in there. Please be quick. Throw it to me. I'm in. Is it safe? Think so. Um, examine. More reading. Uh, cans, electrical goods, miscellaneous. That's okay. I'm not going to read all that. Let me pause the video if you will feel like reading it, but I've read enough. I hate this place all okay, so Hello? Anyone there? I should have checked the door first, but whatever. A bunch of flashlights. Pull your finger out of your ass and open <gasps> Oh damn. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, I'm dead. Hello? Who's there? Yep, this is where he does. <laughs> Jesus. Can't get through. This window is all boarded up. You gave me a shock. Sorry, I, I didn't mean to spook you. How is it in there? I got company of the rodent variety. Gross. Relax. They look well fed. Head to the front. I'll meet you there. Can you step on it? We'd like to get out of here sometime. Sure thing. It's going to block my path. That shelf falling. Hold on. I'll be right there. <sighs> yeah, I'm gonna... Will you relax? I'm coming. troubles you tell me what is happening soon they will come for me calm yourself wife who is coming for you they're talking about me there are accusations accusations of what sort there is talk that i'm in league with the devil that i'm guilty of witchcraft there's no sense in that who would say such a thing why do they all look like uh, them I, I cannot rightly say
Um, let's leave. You are privy to the rumors Please, about sir, my do not family. open that door. Do not let them take me, I beg you, husband. I am here to arrest your wife, Joseph. I have the legal warrant here. Uh. My wife has done nothing wrong. There is a witness to your wife speaking in tongues. Who accuses my wife? Mary. The word of a child condemns my wife. You will deliver yourself into the Marshal's hands for your own good. Then I must accompany her. She will not leave my sight. Such action will not aid your wife's cause. Trust in justice. Do not fear. I will find a way to resolve this. Um. Where the hell have you been? You look freaked. What's up? You saw something else, right? You're not going to believe this, but I saw two people who looked like the professor and Angela. John saw her? Now you've seen her too? Who in the hell is this damn woman who looks like me? Jeez, I thought the professor was blowing smoke up our asses with his Angela twin story. Guess not. To me, it looked like they were married. I know I can get arrested for bad taste of husbands, but god damn. Look like John and look like Angela were an item? Do not say another word, Missy. What kind of weird shit are we mixed up in here? Oh, we've really screwed up here. Instead of getting out of this awful place, we're right back in the middle of town. Oh, he seems nice. What do you think? Let's take a look around. See what we can find. There you go. We'll be on our way from Little Hope while the others are still MIA in the woods. Something up? Yeah, there's something kind of familiar about this place. These small town police stations all look the same. There's got to be a phone in here hmm. someplace. All right, well, I think that will probably do it for the first episode, at least. Um, I'm enjoying it. I'm really confused, um, but it's interesting for sure. And I mean, nothing super freaky. There's some jump scares and stuff, but yeah, it, it's cool. I'm excited to see how the story pans out. Um, not the best at decision making, so feel like I've already doomed quite a few of them to their death. Hopefully the old lady dies. She's the only one that I really don't care for. I mean, John's an asshole too. But anyways, um, yeah, that's going to do it for this episode. So if you did enjoy it, uh, leave a like, maybe comment. Let me know uh, what you like, dislike. It's hard for me to comment and like make conversation in games like these. I I'm going to do my best. But it's these are more about the story it's, uh, it's like a visual novel almost um so it's it's kind of hard for me to make comments and whatnot um but i'll do my best with it but i mean just watching it is probably hopefully entertaining enough but yeah if you guys enjoyed it um i'm going to be continuing with the series but uh until next time take care and i'll catch you in the next episode